Okay, let's give you guys some practice. So somehow integrate this. So press pause and have a go. Okay, so to do this, um, the question is, do you want to integrate this uh, uh, with respect to x first or with respect to y first? And from, from calculus 2, we, um, we've we seen that um, there's no easy way of integrating this. We had to use series in order to integrate this. So, um, so if we integrate it with respect to y first, then we can treat this whole block as a constant. So, so we need to integrate it with respect to y first and then with respect to x. But before we can do that, we need to understand the region in which we're integrating over. So let's just try and understand the region. So this is our x plane, uh, x y plane. Um, at, at the moment, at the moment, as it currently stands, we need to um, we are integrating with respect to x first. So that means we are moving parallel to the x-axis. We are moving along like this. We are moving along like this from which, which means which means this means is x equals something and then x equals something. So uh, so that's our first part here. Um, but then what does this mean? Let's just let's just draw the graph times both sides by 2. So that would be um, 2x equals y. Let's just draw this line. We don't really know what's going on, but let's just draw the line. So it's, it's going to, the line looks like this. This is y equals 2x. Um, uh, so, so currently we are moving parallel to the x-axis, which means we are moving along like this. We are moving along like this. We are moving along like this. We are moving along like this from this line to this. So that means it's this. We are moving along like this. We are moving along like this. We are moving along like this because we are moving from the from the diagonal line to wherever this is. Well, this here is x equals. Uh, let's just say this is. Um, let's just say this is x equals x equals root natural log of 3 so what what this what this means is we are moving from the diagonal line to uh, root natural log of 3 we are moving from the diagonal line to uh, root natural log of 3 so we are moving from the diagonal line to um, to uh, root natural log of 3 we are moving along from the diagonal line to root lin 3 we are moving from the diagonal line to that point so basically we are we are looking at this region here uh let's uh, and and we are scanning from y equals so so this dy here would mean it's going to be y equals here and y equals here so we're scanning from y equals 0 to this place we are scanning from y equals 0 to to this place well this place here is um, is two root natural log of three, so we are we're scanning through like this. We are scanning all the way from zero to uh, to this place here. So we're scanning along like this. So our region, our region is actually this. Hang on, our region is actually this region here. We're moving along like this. We're moving along like this. So this is our region here. But we want to um, we want to integrate. So so currently, this is the, our our current situation is d, uh, dx first and then dy, and then it, it gave us this region. But because we want to switch these two around, which will make our integration a lot easier, we need to change our lim our region. So switching switching these two around would mean this. Switching those regions, switching these two around, would mean would mean we, we can treat this as a constant but then we need to think about our limits of integration so dy so if we want to work in terms of dy first we uh, we have to move parallel to the y-axis so so it means we have to move like this which will mean it's going to be y equals something y equals something well you can see that we are, we are moving from from y equals 0 to the diagonal line 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 the diagonal line is y equals 2x and then we're scanning through well remember for we're scanning through from x equals 0 we're scanning through from x equals 0 and we will stop when we get to here which means well 
dx on the outer integral would mean x equals something, x equals something. Well, we, we're doing it from x equals 0, and, with that, and then we're moving along like this, and then we will stop when we get to root root natural log of 3. So, um, so hang on. Originally, this was given to you. Originally, this was given to you. But we, we don't want to work in terms of dx and then dy. dy. We want to work in terms of dy first and then dx. Well, translating this whole thing here will then give us, will then give us this thing here. So currently, we are at this stage. So currently, currently, we are at this stage. So now it's just a matter of us um, evaluating this. So now let's integrate it. So integrating this uh, with respect to y first. So we can treat this whole thing here as a constant. This is just a constant. So when you integrate it, it will be the constant times y. Uh, from 0 to 2x. From 0 to 2x. So now it's just a matter of us putting this into here. Into uh, into the y because y equals this that will then give us that will then give us this thing here and then take away put the zero into the y and then zero times this thing it would it would be zero so uh, this thing here will then become this and now it's just a matter of integrating this um, if you um, if you integrate this it will give you this thing here um, from 0 to here, from 0 to here. So now when you put this into here, that will then give you this, and then take away, put 0 into here, which will be 1. This this block here will be 1. This block here will be 1. Um, this thing here will be, uh, will be 3. So it's really 3. This block here will be 3. This block here will be 1. Uh, 3 take away 1 will be 2. So the overall, uh, the, the integral equals 2. Okay?